Hello and welcome to Hello and Welcome with your host, Lee. Today, I'm going to teach you how to become a hack comedian and trick legions of angry and hurt people into making you a viral superstar. Yay! There are some prerequisites, however. First, be classically attractive. It's week time. Big time coming down check. And affluent. That makes it a lot easier to upset minorities when you call them thugs, fatties, and whores. <laughs> Second, patriotic music. Don't let them forget that you're not only Hitler's ideal, you're also the American dream. Now, to make sure you're as much a talentless hack as humanly possible, choose from a range of topics, of course, the one that will not only be the easiest, but will also upset and offend the most people. Poke fun at living in a sexist society as a classically attractive woman. Hmm. Probably only get a few thousand views from that. Two. Tease the darkies! Oh, I already did that in my police brutality video, so... Out. Oh, but I love teasing those darkies. They're so funny. <laughs> Number three... <gasps> Fatties! Yes! Done. Now that we have a topic, we need talking points. I'm super positive, so I want to focus on the health benefits of not being a fat slob. Great. Part one. Demonstrate how fatties are slobs. Won't be too hard. Part two, you care about health. You love those disgusting, rotund bags of lard. No, cut rotund. No one can relate to big girl words. Ooh, big girl words. She put that in. <laughs> anyway, this shit's going viral, so make sure you have plenty of snappy one-liners. Hashtags and wacky noises for people to reproduce into all kinds of memes and merch. Let's do that now. Hashtag not funny. Hashtag schoolyard bully. Hashtag I have low self esteem and make other people feel badly about themselves so I can feel better. Now you want to place those regularly throughout the video, especially in places where there's no jokes, just abuse. For example, Hey Larda, as try not to eat so many bar ass bologna sandwiches before you get in line in front of me. You poor, fat piece of shit. I'm positive. Excuse me. Your unacceptable largeness is making my 30-minute Airbus ride extremely unpleasant. Ah! How about you put down the nachos and stop literally murdering yourself? Ah! You bacon-scented slime! <laughs> Who would have thought a dumb bitch would tell the truth instead of just being a lying whore? <laughs> Fuck you, comedy! Speaking of which, make sure you throw in some self-deprecating humor. Maybe call yourself a dumb blonde, but make sure that you call all blondes, no, 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 all women dumb bitches. <laughs> Doesn't even matter if you're actually blonde. No one will notice. Plus, you'll get thousands of views from enraged women all over the globe. Oh, also suggest that you have an eating disorder or a horrible diet to stay thin. But don't take it seriously or anything like that. Just have fun with it. Like, oh, I'm a thin woman. I must have an eating disorder. <laughs> It'll go over fine. Terribly, but fine. Finally, what I think is most important. Makeup, hair, jewelry, outfit, lighting. Let me give you an example. Don't you see, darling? It's all here. Glamour, beauty, fame. All you have to do is be rude. All you have to do is make others weep. That's all. 
Have a nice day.